The JW Speaker 8800 is the world's best and most popular sealed beam 4x6 LED headlight replacement. You see these things on some old cars, but mostly they're used in uh, RVs and semi-trucks. They're also the world's first LED 4x6 to come with an optional heated lens, and that's a big deal because if you're driving your truck in Alaska or through the mountains, you need to be able to melt the frost, ice, and snow off of your headlights. These headlights come in two different styles. You've got a chrome high beam, chrome low beam. You've got black high beam, black low beam, and then you can get them with the heated lens or without. Heated lens is a little bit more money, but it's worth it. In this video, we're gonna do some different time-lapse tests to measure average heat of a traditional incandescent seal beam headlight versus the LED and see how they compare. The big difference in style of the heated lens version versus the non-heated lens are two things. Number one, obviously, you've got the defroster lines on the lens that melt the snow and ice. Number two is the way that it functions is on the far side here, there's a vertical sensor that actually measures the outside temperature of your headlight to tell the defroster to turn on or turn off. And when it's on and heating, you get an LED indicator to know when it's doing its job. So first, let's power up one of these heated lens 8800s. We'll run it for five minutes and test the average temperature of the unit and then compare it to its sealed beam counterpart. So after five minutes, the sealed beam incandescent headlight, I'm seeing numbers like 94, 102 around the edges, 125, 128 in the center. So after everything, it says, uh, average was 115, where I left off happened to say 123. And if we look at the average of the JB speaker one, we're seeing 105, 115, 114, 111.2. So I mean, we're the exact same temperature as that incandescent light. We put one of these headlights in the freezer overnight and we covered it in water. So you can see there's frost all over the place. There's ice chunks on the lens. And now we're gonna run this one and see how fast it takes for it to warm up and melt. Right now, it's at about 19 degrees. So let's see how long it takes for it to heat up. At a minute 45 seconds, the light is at an average temperature of 59 degrees Fahrenheit. At about the two minute mark, you could tell that the frosty lens didn't stand a chance. At three minutes, we're pretty much completely melting all of the ice and snow. And in the other test, before the five minute mark, both the LED headlight and the incandescent seal beam both reach an average temperature around 110 degrees. Therefore, if you are concerned that your 4x6 LED won't melt snow as well as the original incandescent, if you get the heated lens version from JW Speaker, you'll be just fine. Reaches the same lens temperature as the 4x6 in this test. If you have any other questions about the JW Speaker 8800 Evolution 2 LED 4x6 headlights, let us know. You can comment below the video, click the links in the description to go right to our website for more specifications, pictures, and pricing. And of course, you can find us on social media, Facebook, Google+, and Instagram. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you see here, please subscribe so you don't miss the next lighting review video we come out with next.